Okay, on to leaks. Uh, here's a leak. I've just topped it and tailed it. It's still got a bit of the dirt on it from, from the uh, growing process, I presume. And the quick way of doing these is, first of all, we top, we top it just to get rid of the, 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 the untidy stuff and the leathery uh, stuff at the top. And then what I do is I go down them lengthwise like this, all the way down to here but not all the way through. A bit like the onions, yeah? And then I take off the outer leathery ones because we don't want those because they don't taste very good. They're a bit leathery. And then we end up with these bits. Now these are going to be a bit weathered, a bit sandy. So rather than have to chop it up and then drain it and wash it and do all that, we can do it like this. It's a lot easier in this condition. We take it and we peel them apart and we do them that way. Okay, so I'll come back after I've washed it. Okay, back to the leaks. I got the leak back washed, and now we've got it like this, all washed and cleaned up. And then I can run the knife through it as fast as I like and cut it into pieces. You can cut it into bigger chunks if you like, whatever you floats your boat. It's up to you. Leeks impart a delicious flavour to the uh, just about anything, soups, stews, and in in this case, I'm doing a leek and potato soup. Um, a leek and potato soup is a delicious soup um, and I'll probably put up a, a video about that for you. So leek and potato soup, here's another one I prepared earlier and already done. Let's get that chopped up and get it into there. There we go, last bit. Don't need to keep that. Throw that in the bin. So that's the leeks. Leeks, very straightforward. When you're cooking with leeks, things that go really well with leeks are potatoes and anything with cheese is superb with leeks. Um, another one uh, to use, I use with leeks, is um, white pepper. It's rather fond of white pepper, and I'm rather fond of white pepper too, so that works.